Brian, thank you so much. It's been great. Thank you for giving us a house for the last five years. Everybody, give it up for Brian. To every single person who ever bought a ticket, to every single person who ever lifted a power tool, wrote a piece of code, designed anything, worked for free, all of you guys for six years for helping breathe life into the vision of what became my music cast. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. At a time it was a second home. We would, him especially, we would not go home. I see it was our first home, really. <laughs> we knew Brian wasn't making rent. It wasn't that big of a surprise. It was more of a surprise on how long it lasted. Cadence, the voice matches, Blue Glow Skull, City Rebels, Tragedy Andy, Uzi Suicide, Audrey Sessions, Big D in the Kids Table, Frontline, The Facing New York, Lose None, Streetlight Manifesto. It broadcasted with live video and live sound. The rebroadcast is pretty much we take our old shows and queue up certain songs, certain sets of bands people want to see. They'll go into the chat room, they'll say who they want to play, and then we'll play. And that's in between us talking, like a live, like just like a talk show kind of thing. The most notable thing about the show is actually how much potential the venue had, but um, their intention seemed to be uh, pushing these uh, internet streamed videos uh, to bands and, and trying to record press kits for bands to put up on, on the internet and to promote themselves. And my music has welcomed everyone. No matter who you were, you could have been the worst band ever. Okay, let's do the emo song now, okay? The emo song, just play hella slow. Play hella slow. Everybody, sustain. Pick, pick, pick one, one note. Pick one note. Pick, pick one, one note. Pick one note. Pick one note. And you f stay on those as long as you can. can. Okay? Pizza yeah, High Five was a joke band that can play at this venue. Like, <laughs> everyone got a chance. At least I mean, once to to pull in. If you can get your fans to cut your friends to come as fans. Uh, if you had like 40, 50 people to come out for you, we'd book you again. There's something called an L3, which stands for Live, Loud, and Local. And it's pretty much the matches, whenever the matches would play, it was like their show. It um, came with a, a, a bit of sign language.
It was such a great thing for the community, especially with music venues these days, everything's disappearing. 21 and over venue, maybe here, like a bar there. It's your favorite bands, when they come in to work, they, sometimes they even skip over San Francisco these days. They, there's just nowhere to play. Slims is overpacked. So, a band you might love, but the world doesn't know, can't come out here anymore because there's nowhere to play.